Thank you. Thank you. Why do we buy? I mean, beyond the most necessary life sustaining items, why do we buy into a product, a service, or a brand? What influences us to become passionate enough to show preference towards one similar item over another? While we may choose different terms like storytelling or branding as the answer to this question, really, it comes down to communication. A brand story is merely the way they communicate their value to the world. We constantly hear about Apple as the pinnacle of brands, or Zappos as the most obsessed customer service company on the planet. But is Apple really the very best? Does Zappos deliver better customer service than any other organization? Arguably, you could say yes or no. Because neither of these statements are objective enough to be right or wrong. But why do people feel this way about these brands? Why will an Apple evangelist basically go to battle with anyone who insults the company? Why is this company so beloved in a time where social media rules, but they don't even have social media presence? They don't build communities on any sites other than their own. Yet everyone wants to be associated with them. Let me share a little story. When I bought my first Apple computer, I was convinced to buy a service called One to One. For those of you that have an Apple, you may rem remember this or have used this. It would cost a few hundred dollars. But the idea was it allowed me to get the support and even take classes that could help me become an expert on how to use my Apple device. Having been a PC user for a long time, I had a lot of questions. And while they said, oh, the change with Apple is so intuitive for me, you know, it wasn't. But after a few months, I, I was like everyone else. I became hooked. Everything just seemed easier. And if I didn't know how to fix it, I called the help and it would be right there. And all this is great. But again, is it why I became a believer, a diehard fan? I support Apple, even though my stake in them is really very nominal. So is Apple really so much better than their competitors? Does Zappos really reach further when it comes to customer service? As I suggested, the answer is maybe. But what I will tell you for sure is their communication of their story, their values, and their journey is so much more compelling than the competition that they consistently rise to the top of mind within their audience. In the end, it is always communication. It is the ability for a person to feel that intimate connection to another company or another person that builds loyalty, the loyalty that brands work so hard to achieve. And in a world littered with mass communication, brands are essentially screaming into their mega horns. The real possibilities for companies is to use technology not for that, but to be more personal, more connected, and to communicate in a way that turns lurkers into prospects, prospects into customers, and customers into lifelong brand advocates. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm.